Don't forget to check out our sponsor, The Hell Blaze, at thehellblaze.com. 100% all natural products from lotions, soaps, foot soaks, bath bombs, and much, much more. Use the promo code goodfella one boxing Tell them your boy CJ Goodfella since you get 18% off. We out. All right, man, we back. Goodfella Sports TV and, you know, Kroger, the grocery you know, store chain that's basically a Midwest chain. And Amazon is expected to take away their $2 hazard pay for their employees like the coronavirus just has been cured or just picked up and left and went to another planet. Let's talk about it, man. Make sure you check out our current news playlist for more videos like this. Don't forget we're on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. You can reach out anytime if you have a business question, call, response, ship, or video request. Appreciate the love, support, and um, that's just my face about it. Um, Kroger was even trying to recoup, saying they overpaid. It was the stories out there. They recouped, and they overpaid for the uh, for the hazard pay, and they wanted to recoup around, I think it was like $600 that they overpaid, and you could take it out in, in one uh, installment, two or three installments, or if you need other arrangements to pay it back. Just let you know how cruel some of these companies is, man. You got a lot of people that go to work and put their life on the line every day. You got nurses with, with or without the coronavirus, you know, a lot of places, you know, in those Home Depot, Menards type of ish places, I've seen people die where a pallet of shit fall on them and they did, you know, when the plants, you know, they going back to work starting, you know, last week, this week, they put their life on the line. I seen, you know, I worked in the plant as a uh, first responder, you know what I'm saying? That was part of my job. And I seen, you know, a dude, uh, Lou get his legs amputated because he got ran over by a high low. I seen a dude, you know, uh, take a nap on his lunch break and end up, you know, passing away in his sleep due to a heart attack. You know, I seen, you know, a lot of shit fall on people before and these companies don't care. You know what I'm saying? I remember, uh, it's a story and a lot of motherfuckers remember this at Jefferson North that worked there. Uh, a guy found his wife was cheating, you know, whatever. And I'm gonna tell you the point of this before I get to the, the rest of the video was cheating. So he, somehow he got in and then, um, I think he chased the girl to Belle Isle. She was trying to get away and he killed both of them right on the motherfucking, you know, right on the island down the street. Kind of like the little spot we kick it at. We used to kick it. I ain't been there since like shit, the early 2000s. But, uh, and you know, one thing about it, they might have, that for that incident, they might have stopped for a day. Maybe not even a day. One thing about it, that line keep rolling. Every time an incident happened like that, the moment to breathe, the grieve and the line keep rolling. It ain't stopping for nothing. And they give you some type of, you know, insurance policy play that ain't really shit. That's just, you know, normal. And they don't care about your family. They don't care about you. They don't care about nobody. You know what I'm saying? And and for Kroger, and, you know, specifically, I won't be shopping there. I used to work there. That was my first, well, it was my first official job, you know, um, in high school or working at Kroger. And, um, yeah, I, I, I won't shop there no more. I don't really shop there like that. They got some good rotisserie chicken, but, you know, when I don't want to go in Walmart, I may go in there. But to try to recoup that money, and then now they're saying they're going to give it to them in the form of, of, of a $200 or $400 bonus and, and all at once. What's that going to do for me? $2 wasn't enough for me to be going to Kroger and, and dealing with people that got the coronavirus. You talking about two or $400? You know, I know some people that some CNAs. And they bonus check was two or three, four hundred dollars, and they work on all these sick people who get the coronavirus. What's two or four hundred dollars gonna do? That just lets you know what they think about about you as a worker. You know what I'm saying? And the best bet is to get out there and be an entrepreneur, buy some property. You know what I'm saying? Go in with, with your with your with your close homies, buy some properties, and keep it moving. The Amazon, don't let me get started on him. Uh Jeff Bezos, he made thirty billion dollars since the coronavirus, bro. And you taking the two dollar hazard pay? What's two dollars? You should be giving each one of your employees twenty, thirty, thirty thousand in bonuses. The fleet truck workers, the warehouse workers, you know, you know, they don't allow you to sit down in there at all. You got to stand up 10, 12 hours, depending on what your shift is, ankles. That's not a place you want to retire neither. At least get them some more, you know, shares in the company. Damn. What's $2 to a nigga that just made $30 billion since the coronavirus? $30 billion. He made a billion in the first under 30 days. But this is what they think about their employees. This is why I treat jobs the way I treat them. You do all that work and look at your 401k and ain't nothing in there. 
You put all this work in right now and your, you don't have nothing in social security when you get older, but they take it out your check. Look at all, it, it, look, it, it goes no worse than this. You see people that serve their country. They put their life and their balls on the fucking line for this country and they on the corner broke, begging for food. The VA don't want to help them. Excuse me. Let me hurt you. The VA don't want to help them. You know what I'm saying? That's that's America for you. This dude made 30, Jeff Bezos made $30 billion since the coronavirus. And now he's taking away their $2 raise. What's $2? What's $2? That's 80 extra dollars per 40 per 40 hour shifts. That's it. 80 extra dollars before Uncle Sam's taxes. And if the government truly cared, all essential workers shouldn't even be paying taxes right now. Jeff Bezos pays no taxes. I bet Kroger pays minimum taxes. A lot of the big three, they pay minimum, they pay minimum taxes. That's why one of the reasons they get another tax break for allowing nonviolent felons to work in the plant. But you go there and put your life on the line. $15 an hour that ain't enough. $20 an hour ain't, ain't enough to put your life on the line, even to consider it. A lot of these dudes should be making 30 minimum and they can pay it. McDonald's can easily pay more than eight, nine million dollars an hour. They don't, that's why I don't care if they turn over Ray Hot. But that dude from the Amazon is straight, the straight the devil, bro. No doubt about it. Kroger, straight the devil, bro. You know what I'm saying? He ain't he ain't even trying to look out for his employees, dog. He ain't trying to get them a few bands, you know, twenty thousand, thirty. He can easily give each one of his employees twenty, thirty thousand dollars for doing this. Especially when it's over with. Oh, we're gonna take the two dollars back. Man, I'll walk out that hoe. Straight up and down. Manager I ain't like, I'll take a cup of piss and throw it in his face, her face. Straight up and down. I shouldn't be paying no taxes. If I'm an essential worker, a two dollar raise, what is two dollars? Eighty dollars per per forty hours a week. If you get by weekly, it's an extra one sixty. They gonna tax it by twenty. Come on, twenty percent minimum. And this how they this how they this how they gonna treat their employees. So I'll tell you, America, man, corporate America, is, man. Once people get past the law and understand the law and the Bible is to protect the rich and the wealthy. Yes, they understand it. A lot of people don't care about politics, but a lot of these poly businesses ain't paying no 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 taxes, bro. But they taxing our check before we even, you know, they taking our money before we can get it. You know, but shame on Kroger. Done with them. Shame on Amazon. I'm done with them. I care how much good shit they got on there. All these employees should be should be making twenty five, thirty dollars an hour. You know, but hey, it is what it is. Let me know what you guys think. I'll put the article in the description. Don't forget me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter. Reach out if you got business questions, quality response, your video request, Twitter the quickest way. Want to make a donation to the channel? Cash out, PayPal, in the description. Best way to donate, share the video. Don't forget, check out our current news playlist. One time for the one time we go.